So I've got my Echo 590 cylinder here. Uh, I've got a little bit of grinding done on it. Um, so what I've done on this cylinder so far, let me zoom in. Um, the lower transfers, the openings here, this divider, I made smaller. Now, I've tried channeling. You got your primary and your secondary. I've tried channeling the primary a little more. And that's the smaller one up top. It's kind of ugly looking in the camera here, but I've tried getting more air channeled to the primary. Um, again, made the divider smaller, thinking more air in. Um, I guess we'll see how it works. The secondary, just kind of cleaned up the edges a little bit, tried rounding off, especially here by the divider. Um, divider or ring support piece, I guess, whichever you'd consider that. Just tried getting a few of the edges rounded off. This side, just as ugly. <laughs> um, not the most proud of how this looks, but I'm not fully certain on what to do anymore there. Um, this is going to go back together with no base gasket. Uh, the exhaust, I got to sand and polish that up yet, but... The exhaust is a lot wider. Um, I've raised it substantially. So that exhaust port, eh, decently um, rounded center of the roof. Kind of opened up the side so there's no step. That's a pretty straight shot from the cylinder wall to the outlet flange here. Um, happy with how that one turned out. And then lastly, well, one, I have not touched the intake. Um, it seems like these Echoes have a lot of intake duration, so I'm, I'm not doing anything there. Um, now this is my first cylinder on trying to get in and do any work on upper transfers. Um... The secondary here and this primary, these turned out okay. Now I, I've raised those a few degrees for some less blowdown. Um, now that I got the cylinder clean up, you can see some of the kind of pitting in the cylinder, which is why I figured it was a good one to start with and a good test piece. But um, yeah, raise the upper transfers. Um, I'm still trying to figure out what bits and tooling works best for me to get in there. I have not come up with, I guess, what I think is a good recipe for myself. Um, that side is just ugly as can be. So, again, good cylinder to start with, a junk one, just kind of see what happens and it, uh, I don't know. Just gonna put it together, get it on the saw once. Uh, once I get that exhaust polished up, I gotta do a muffler mod yet. But um, got the little red barn pop up piston and just gonna give her hell. See what happens. Um, nothing really to lose on this one with the condition that the cylinder was in before. So if it doesn't run too well, I'll take my other 590 and. Um, probably just do a little bit of exhaust modification only, throw the pop-up piston, or put that cylinder on with the pop-up piston and just leave it as is, not really, uh, messing with the transfers like I tried to do on this one, so. Pretty soon, we'll see how she runs.